we're making an entire chicken pot pie. It's my take on a, uh, an American pot pie crossed with a French dish called poulot po, which is basically chicken in a pot. So we have our chicken, and this is always, I always like to season my chicken a little bit ahead, because right. it lets the flavors really get in there. Me too. I, yeah. I leave it overnight uncovered in the fridge, exactly. if I can. It's, yeah. Right, or you can even do an hour or two ahead, and this just has some grated garlic, it's got some chopped thyme, salt and pepper. You just let it hang out in the fridge for a couple hours, or right. overnight if you can. Okay, then you want to make, so you have that already, then right. you want to make your sauce. So your sauce is all about the vegetables. I've got leeks, I've got carrots, I've got mushrooms. What a beautiful dish going into spring, too. I know. Really leeks, perfect right? The time. Right. It's all good already. I'm going to put a little butter. I'm going to make a roux. So you know, like when you make a sauce for chicken pot pie, exactly. It's just you butter have to have a thickening agent and flour, and you just want to cook it until the flour gets a little bit, you know, just until it comes brown. together, right? And that's what we have and over that's here. And this guy here. So. That's come together, and then all you want to do is add your liquid. So you want to add your chicken stock. Yum. And so simple. So simple. So simple. And then you want to add a good splash of wine. That's what's left from the sauce there that we And then poured. we drink whatever's <laughs> left. I just put the chicken in the pot, and then that simmers just like that for 30 minutes. And then it's this And guy? then this is what it turns into. Oh, I got to see this. So Gorgeous. look at that. Here. Yeah, Bonnie, see look. how that? So at oh. this point, it's like halfway cooked. It's almost done. All right. And I'm going to add. So now you add your fresh peas. Yeah, I'm going to add some fresh peas. Beautiful. And I'm yeah. going to add a lot of herbs. I've got you, whatever you have. I've got dill and tarragon and parsley. I love and tarragon. And basil and, and dill is so undervalued. I love, love dill. Stuff. Right. Yes. Yeah. It just feels healthy, too. So you just put that in. And then here is the here's the part that makes it into a pot pie, right? You have mm. your pa your puff pastry, which you just buy at which the grocery you just store. buy at Hello. the grocery store, exactly. And Thank all, you, Do Four. Yes. yes, you do love. <laughs> I love yeah. I love puff pastry because it's it so, so easy much. and it's so buttery. Right. And I'm just putting a little egg wash on it because this helps it get brown. Right. So if you can put a little bit, you don't even need that much. You just a thin layer of egg wash. It just gives it that extra golden exactly. glow. Exactly. And then this is the hard part. Hard. Oh <laughs> that is all Can I show you do. Oh. Look how gorgeous that is. That is what it bakes up into. Yum. Gorgeous. 25 minutes in the oven. 25 to 30. You're just cooking the puff pastry. The chicken yeah. is just finishing. The chicken is finishing. It's exactly. So and that is just gor so gorgeous. But it's and so it gets easy. Yeah. Yeah. And you don't okay, have make to the aioli. Quick, okay, quick, so quick. I've got garlic in here. I have lemon juice. I have salt, right? And I'm garlic, just lemon juice, salt. And you just the garlic makes it. It's like a mayonnaise, but the garlic makes it aioli. That's all. Right, right, right. So egg and, and egg yolk. it fresh makes it an aioli. Oh, like it's not a so store bought. Much, yeah, right. Well, this true. is fresh, and it takes a minute. I mean, this really just takes one minute. I'm adding herbs. I'm adding tarragon and parsley. Yum. Yummy. And I'm gonna just turn it up. And so you've got the egg, and you've got the garlic, garlic, and the acid. lemon juice, yep. salt. And then I've got my eggs and I've got my herbs. And then I'm just gonna pour and in. And then this you is just stream in the olive oil. Yeah, you just go slow, but not too slow. Healthy fat. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. And then it thickens. You see how it's getting thick already? Um, as I said, you can read, uh, Melissa, not only in her books, but every single week, the that Wednesday New York Times, to which I still subscribe, yeah. I actually read real newspapers and real books. You gotta show them the chicken, I show do. off. I have to, okay, so mm. what you do is when you serve it, you take the puff pastry, you move it to the side, you take your chicken out, see if I get can. Get it, get it. Come on, you can do it, you can do it. Whoa. She did four oh. push-ups this morning. I did. Yum. That, that juice looks and then delicious. That, and then that, that's you, what happens. That's, that's the sauce. situation. The pump you paste dressing yes, into, you dunk into you dunk it. the sauce. Can you Melissa, listen? no matter how you did in French class, wants everybody to class up their dinner. You're all going home with a copy of Dinner in French. <laughs>